Scrubbies. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a hardcore run. My first hardcore run, and this was a challenge actually sent to me by Sir Rocka Steve. Thank you so much, Sir Rocka Steve. Uh, he recommended that I play Hardcore Path of Exile as a noob. Now, I don't know very much. Um, I think I got to like 35 before. Definitely still would consider myself a noob. Definitely not very good uh, in the realm of the world. Let me turn that down so I can hear myself here. Uh... Okay, so my timer wasn't working there and I had to stop the recording. But uh, what I was saying there, uh, Sirox D recommended that I go ranged over melee as a hardcore, especially for my first. And he also recommended the witch with something else. And I can't remember exactly what he wrote there. But I, I probably won't even find the gems that he's uh, that he's recommended for a while. Oh, oh, I forgot about that. That's really cool. Oh, wands are cool. Okay, so I'm not going to do... I'm probably only going to do two episodes in this session so that I can get some feedback in between. And uh, we're going to turn this into kind of like a, um, a community playthrough. We'll all we'll, we'll get through it together. I shall be the controller, but you will tell me... You will tell me how to go. Okay. Um, never played a hardcore character before other than... I think I played... I got to level 10... Uh, hardcore <clears throat> with a uh, Diablo 3 character. Oh, I'm out of mana. I was wondering. <laughs> I was just standing there. I thought I was DCing. I'm on the highest graphic setting. I, I don't know why it didn't. Uh, it wasn't working for me months ago, and I haven't updated anything. Uh, but uh, now I can run it perfectly, so there you go. I hope you enjoy the audio fidelity as well. I worked really hard all morning to get this uh, this microphone to work this hard. Now, being that this is hardcore and I don't play Path of Exile very often, I may stop talking <laughs> because I might have to focus on some stuff. Okay. Now, I didn't read up on much. I, I wanted to go into this as a noob, and then as we go through, I'll get better and better with your feedback and whatnot. Um, so I don't know exactly where I'm going with the passive skill tree, though I imagine I won't screw up that hard with the first few. So I'm guessing... How does that... Oh, yeah. The mana regen, 25% at the start is just massive. I think that's probably a safe bet to go. Let me know what you think, though. I mean, if you, even if you disagree with uh, ranged or, or the fact that this is a, a witch, just let me know. I would love to know, and uh, it doesn't have to be my only hardcore run-through. We can try some other stuff. I, uh, I really like this idea of having uh, the community... Uh, recommend ideas and where they want to see the character go and then because I'm not really into to, to PoE I, I really like Diablo 3 and uh, there's a few things that I would agree that on, on a lot of uh, fronts that uh, PoE does really well um, and a few things that like uh, Diablo 3 has the I think they're called runes where it's like you you um, you can make your punch do fire damage or ice damage or something and this game took it even further with adding really any combinations that you want. Uh, and I really like that. Though I much prefer the Diablo 3 art style and the way that they... Um, um, oh no, just just the basic gameplay feel. I find that it feels a little better. At the beginning here, this is one of my, one of my favorite parts of Path of Exile because everything's... it's uh, The art style was... It's obvious where things are. I found that in Act uh, 2 and 3 that things get a little um, fuzzy? Is that the word I'm looking for? Uh, also, if you notice that I keep pressing the wrong buttons when I'm trying to hit my potions, I can't actually see my hands with the microphone in front of me. So that could be a reason I lose here. That could really be my demise is because I pressed the wrong button at the wrong time. Okay. I've been talking for a while now. Am I supposed to be clearing things out? I'm guessing so. You probably want experience in hardcore before you move on to the harder places, right? Am I right? This would be a lot more fun if it was streaming. I would love to stream, personally, but uh, I don't have the internet connection. Oh, hello, Hil Hillock. I, I've been calling him Hilltalk for years. <laughs> I probably haven't played this game for years. Let's test the waters here. How much damage does he do? Oh, wow. Okay. Well, oh, that's a tiny shield. Okay, so it's uh, it's pretty easy at the beginning. I also really like how 
hardcore turns back into uh, a standard character. Like losing your character completely is not a good idea for me. Though I know that my brother really enjoys hardcore in uh, in Diablo 3. Uh, I think that's just because he's played for too long to enjoy the game uh, without that uh, that pro or uh, what am I looking for? The uh, the consequence. I totally get that. I uh, I play on. I know you. Like, most people like to play Diablo three, where they just blast through it, go as fast as possible. But I play it on the hardest oh, difficulty I possibly much. can go through it at, because that's just more fun for me. I enjoy that. I work with Hillock. Okay, give me that reward, boy. Lightning, freeze, pulse, raise zombie. Oh, freeze, pulse, freezes enemies that passes through that's probably pretty useful but then again having a zombie minion to stop me yeah I'm gonna go with this for now but uh, let me know what you think about that be constructive of course <laughs> greetings <laughs> it's funny that I have to say that there are people who will just say Gareth you suck <laughs> that doesn't help me I can't figure shit out, man. Okay. I don't like that there. I'm gonna remove that and put it on Q. No. R. Yes. Arise, my zombie. Oh, I do I have to kill things first? I do. Arise, my zombie. Kill my foes. Now you arise, too. Now I've got two. Yay. Now you come up too. Now we got three zombies. Three zippity zombs. Take them out, my minions. If you die, you will not revert to standard league. <laughs> but I will. Save me! Save me, my beasts! I'm probably gonna get hit a few times thinking that the zombie approaching me is mine. <laughs> Did I lose a zombie? How long do they last? Oh shit. Oh, I do not like that teleporting enemy. Well, unless they're... No, actually, I don't even like teleporters that are supposed to teleport. How long is that supposed to last? Are they dying, or do they just disappear after a certain time? That's a good question. Which will follow you and attack enemies. Uh, is there a advanced version of that? Can I read something better? Uh, spell damage, spell damage, int. Yeah, maximum energy. I was laughing pretty hard last night. I was testing this game out to see if I, if everything would record properly. And uh, <laughs> I died right here. <laughs> I found that pretty funny. Uh, I should probably go for resistance or um, health first, or defense first, I guess. It gives me that. That gives me an energy shield. That gives me mana, energy shield, energy shield, and mana. Hmm. Hmm. -hmm. Oh, here we have... Oh, shit! Ah! Okay. <laughs> yeah. It's a good start. It's a good start, Griff. <laughs> Alright. Uh, I'm just gonna take a safe bet and go with Int, because that gives me both um, that gives me spell power, right? Let me check that. Uh, int gives me mana and energy shield. Okay, so no, it does not give me damage. But that's okay. Uh, I saw a little flow chart, or what do you want? What do you call those? Ch those when you, when you have the um, just put it on the screen there, Future Girth. I don't, I don't even know how to explain it, but just when they describe uh, what is better, than, like this is greater than that, and that is greater than this. And I got that from uh, Soraka Steve, and he explained some order. I'm pretty sure defense was first and damage was last. Maybe something about resist, evasion, dodge. Yeah, so pretty much all just defensive stuff. It's kind of seeming like the zombies are dying, though. I'm sure if you're watching this, you... Pr or I'm not, not sure, actually, but if you're watching this, you probably know already. <laughs> Arise, my zombies. Murder my foes. For I do not wish to do it myself. 
I really enjoy Fireball, though, although I have a feeling that's not my main thing. Once I get the correct gem, I can't remember what it was called. Something about damaging things. Something about a wave, or a beam, or... <laughs> Ooh. Now, I heard... A, I, I know now, I, I went and looked it up, and I know how to revert the your gems to... Oh, hello. Uh, to a lower level, though I'm not sure why, and I would love it to, if someone could, could explain it to me. I have a feeling it's something to do with maybe the mana cost or the requirements for int and strength and stuff like that. All right, that's the end of the episode. Thank you so much for joining me. I will be continuing this series until Hardcore Girth's death... That's the name of this character. <laughs> <laughs> Ugh.